So this morning I was woken when my Dyson fan started rattling, so that's what we're gonna be fixing today. So you're gonna start off and there is a tab right there that you can push on. It takes some doing, but once you get it just lifted up, it's not that hard to push out. And once you get it out, there's gonna be a screw right underneath there. You're gonna need a small star head screwdriver to get that out and once you do it comes out pretty quick. Now to get the head off you're gonna have to turn it counterclockwise and then you'll be able to just lift up and pull it out. Now I took this apart earlier before I started recording it and there's gonna be these wires clipped down. They're pretty easy to get undone. First you're gonna have to pull towards you and then the black one will be connected on the far end. You'll have to push it away. Now what's happening wrong is these four screws. I'll explain later in the video exactly what's going wrong with them, but you'll just need to tighten those four screws in. Essentially, they come unscrewed during the process of the fan moving, I'm assuming, and you just need to screw those back in. So once you tighten them up, you can just clip those wires back in where they had been, and then you just put the top back on. This one's a little tricky to get. You're gonna put the top back on, you're gonna turn it left, and then pull it back clockwise. And the hardest part is going to be getting that screw back in because it's just a blank hole. They didn't bore it out very well. Um, but once you get that back in, it screws in pretty easy. And then you just snap the nub back on and there's no more noise. So why exactly is it those four screws? I kind of explained that it might have been the fan doing it as it moved. But it's these four screws right here. Now I had disassembled this earlier and that's why it's about to break apart here. Essentially this moves and it moves in this compartment. Now if it gets close, too close to this edge right here, it'll produce this horrible noise. Um, and there's a little bit of a distance right there. This is kind of the noise that it makes when it turns. Now if you push that in though and spin it, there's almost no noise. So when you screw those four screws in, this black bit screws into the piece that had the fan bit on it. So screwing those in kind of lifts it up out of the chamber. You're gonna wanna try to screw them in as much as you can, get as much of a gap between the fan bit and the housing it sits in. 